Next on the list, it's Random Acts of Kindness Week, and we're surprising local community members. We wanted to make sure you got flowers. Yeah. Plus, creating up the perfect Valentine's gift. Hey everyone, welcome back to the list. During this Random Acts of Kindness Week, a Kansas City man wants to help us all commit our own acts of good. Mitch Weber tagged along on a story people are sharing about KC. Doing good at number one. Are you Holly? This is how Random Acts of Kindness Week started for Holly Buckendall. We wanted to make sure you got flowers. Thank you. Yay. Thank you much. The Acts of Good Journal partnered with studio Dan Miners to surprise people. Each recipient was nominated. I was really surprised this morning. That was really what I needed today. Now, it's Holly's turn. They're then prompted to pay it forward, to do an act of good for the next person. There are 12 entries in the Acts of Good Journal. The owner writes in the first random act of kindness, then mails it off to someone else. Any city, anywhere in the world, um, collecting the stories of the lives touched along the way. In the end, the journal comes back to the original owner. For more info, head to listtv.com. At number two, a new plaza restaurant is taking shape. The first Zoe's Kitchen in Kansas or Missouri will open next month. The chain is known for Mediterranean-inspired fresh food. Signature items include salads, kebabs, roll-ups, and hummus. Many menu items are grilled. The restaurants don't have microwaves or fryers. There are gluten-free, vegetarian, and vegan options. At number three, three ways to crate up a great gift that could make it in time for Valentine's Day. Two sisters created Velvet Crate. It's an online gift boutique, so it's really set up for people to send gifts for special occasions. Amy still lives in KC. She works on the business stuff. Sister Allison does most of the buying. What we have here is a representation of our summer crate. We've got a fall crate as well as our, our winter. Each season has three crates, one for love, one to celebrate things like birthdays or big occasions, and one just because. Winter's Just Because featured a china mug, hand cream, and caramel from Beverly Hills, but they're starting to feature more local items. Now you're caught up in clued in around KC.